Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, we're gonna be looking at how to create a landing page using Instapage. Now, landing pages are not, as I used to think of them, the front page of your website. A landing page is a standalone page and a marketing tool that users see when they click on an ad or a link. Its only purpose is to get that visitor to act, either sign up for a free trial, buy a product, or download an ebook, or whatever else it is you want them to do. So I thought I had a cool website until I realized just how important landing pages are for conversions. Once someone recommended Instapage and I used it to create personalized landing pages depending on which ads viewers came from, after that experience, I can honestly say that a multiple landing page marketing strategy can be a game changer for any business, but especially for online companies. Now, let me tell you what I've learned after using the Instapage landing page builder, how much it costs, what it's like to use, what it's good for, and what could be improved. So if you're looking to launch a new ad campaign and want your landing page to play an active role in turning in more conversions, I hope this will help you decide if Instapage is the right service for you or not. And if you find this review interesting or helpful, you can show your appreciation by liking this video and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already to see more of my honest reviews. And just to be upfront, I'm an affiliate of pretty much all the companies that I talk about, including Instapage, but my recommendation wouldn't mean much if I didn't always give my honest opinion. Now, if at any point you do decide to try Instapage, you can use the affiliate link in the description down below. It doesn't cost you anything, and you might even get a bit of a discount, which you wouldn't get if you went right to their website. All right, now let's get right into it. All right, so for those of you who haven't already heard about Instapage, it's a cloud host subscription service that's used to create standalone landing pages to interact with customers, generate leads, and ultimately make more sales. And what really makes it a great choice for me personally is that you don't need any design or coding skills to use it. That said, it's packed with features to help you design effective sales generating landing pages. And what really caught my attention is that it also offers a bunch of advanced features like ad mapping, AI generated content, heat maps, and split testing tools that help you put your user data to work on well-designed landing pages that not only load faster, but also help you achieve your marketing goals quicker. You can create ad to landing pathways that are made for each ad market segment or area to target different audiences and marketing goals with effective customized content that results in sales and insightful data that you can use going forward. Now, one thing I learned from trying Instapage myself was how to create a landing page in the first place. I was really impressed by how professional and quick to respond their customer support is, detailing everything you need to know about landing pages, and they even offer a landing page tutorial and a step-by-step -step guide that explains every aspect of how to build a landing page and what it should contain. And once you understand how everything works, you can get started with their drag and drop page creation tool that's really easy to use. But take it from personal experience, it's a lot easier to pick one of their more than 100 templates that are all 100% mobile responsive. Plus, if you're working in a team or with a client, the collaboration tool makes it really easy to do stuff in real time. And once your landing pages are designed and ready, you can use the tools I've mentioned earlier to analyze and test your campaigns and gather useful data from your visitors. Now that we've covered all the features that Instapage offers, let's move on to the pricing and plans. So when it comes to their subscription plans, they offer the build plan for around 200 bucks a month if you pay for the year, or about $300 a month if you pay monthly, which makes it ideal for people who are just starting out with using landing pages or for small businesses. And to be honest, it has everything you need to create an optimized post-click landing pages if your aim is to boost sales. And another good thing about this plan is that it doesn't have any conversion or domain limits. You get full access to the landing page creator, a pick of useful widgets, and all the optimization tools like the post-click scoring system that lets you know how well individual campaigns are doing. And what really sold the plan to me is that the landing pages are really easy to integrate with your existing website because they're independently hosted in the Instapage cloud and they are already GDPR compliant as well as SSL encrypted. Aside from creating and personalizing landing pages, you can also build forms to capture data from visitors by using their AI-driven content generator. Now, you might be thinking that it's really difficult to create a lot of landing pages and there's a lot of hassle, but they have an Instablock feature that really helps by allowing you to reuse blocks of content from your personal library whenever you create a new page. Another cool feature is AMP, AMP or Accelerated Mobile Pages for campaigns targeted at phones. 
And I gotta hand it to them for including this feature to create those sleek out of the box mobile landing pages that just load so fast that people stay engaged. And they also integrate with Zapier, HubSpot, Salesforce, and Marketo. Now, if you have a bigger business, an agency or a team and need more pages than standard use would cover, you can opt for the convert plan, which can be customized to fit your needs and goals. This is the expanded use package that basically has all the same features as the others, except the amount of use and pages that you can create. On the flip side though, you need to get a demo from Instapage because they don't have a price for this plan on their website currently. So to sum it up, both plans are fully customizable with lots of advanced features. For instance, you can get a visual ad map of your campaigns or a heat map that shows what actions visitors take and how long they spend on your landing pages. This helps you find and fix issues related to user experience, like buttons that aren't being used because they're placed too far down or other design related problems. Speaking of other add-ons, they include audit logs, bulk leads, page migration, custom fonts and integration, conversion consulting and design services, or your very own customer success manager if you opt for it. And if Instapage sounds like the right tool for you, but you wanna try it before you commit, all the plans come with a 14 day free trial, but once you subscribe, you only have 24 hours to qualify for a full refund. So if you change your mind about it for whatever reason, you have to let them know immediately, otherwise your subscription is non-refundable and they will carry it on to the end. So make use of the two week free trial if you're unsure. But if at any point you decide that you wanna try Instapage, you can use the affiliate link that's down in the description below. It doesn't cost you anything and you might get a bit of a discount, which you wouldn't get if you went directly to their website, like I mentioned before. Now, when it comes to user experience with Instapage, it was mostly positive. I needed a way to track the efficiency of my pay per click advertising campaign campaigns, and I wanted to collect information from my customers using forms. But most of all, I wanted to experiment with different kinds of offers, promotions, and calls to action to see which one worked best. So I really, really enjoyed using and made the best use out of the A-B testing function. What I really liked about Instapage as well is that I had a great choice of page designs to customize in the template library, which I also found to be a good source of inspiration. And you have a lot of freedom in how you enhance and build your landing pages. And I gotta hand it to Instapage for including the drag and drop editor, which saved me a lot of time. Although I feel like they could have included a wider selection of widgets, I found enough for my pretty basic needs like videos, images, and different buttons. Also, the one feature that really, really stood out for me the most was Instablocks because it allowed me to reuse the same pre-built assets like the testimonial block that features positive client feedback quotes on any page I design without having to build it from scratch every single time. So when I think back to the first time I made a landing page using their landing page tutorial, I remember that it really helped me learn how to create a landing page and more importantly, why you need to design it in a certain way to turn in more conversions. I do wish they had a more affordable plan for smaller businesses, but I gotta say there has been a decent return on that investment. And so far I've extended my marketing to target people in specific neighborhoods, which has worked out well for me. Also by using their built-in analytics, I can see quite clearly what works and what doesn't for me, which saved me from wasting any more money on ads that didn't bring in any more sales. All right, so when it comes to competition, like I said, I've used a few landing page builders and Instapage is the most sophisticated out of all of them, but all those advanced features come at a cost. So if you have different needs, one of these alternatives might work better for you. Now, based on my experience, the competitors worth mentioning are Unbounce, lead pages, and click funnels. First up is Unbounce, which has most of the same features as Instapage, like heat maps and tools to leave comments for easy collaboration. Okay, so I do think that Unbounce does have more variety in their plans, but I still think that Instapage leads the way by having far better mobile responsiveness, a smoother page builder, a faster process, and no bugs that I've seen in my testing. And moving on to the next one, if budget is your biggest issue, then you might wanna try lead pages because their basic plan costs around $50 per month. Okay, so a feature this service has that you probably won't find anywhere else is the ability to be able to add pop-ups to landing pages. But take it from me and probably yourself also, when pop-ups come on, they're really irritating and annoying, so I wouldn't add them to your site if I were you. And after using the Instapage editor, it would definitely be more difficult for me to go back to lead pages where it took a lot of work just to get pages looking how I wanted them. Finally, there's ClickFunnels, which costs about $30 more than Instapage, but that might be because it offers customer checkouts and lets you capture leads and send emails as well. 
and you can use it to build landing pages, but the downside is that you won't get any of the more advanced features that you get with Instapage and the page templates are not as sleek, responsive, or nearly as beautiful as the ones in the Instapage collection. The bottom line, is Instapage the best landing page builder that you can use today to reach your sales and marketing goals? Well, in my case, it's been a pleasure to use and I learned a lot about the power of landing pages, especially when they're designed and used properly. Now, I did originally think that I was paying a lot of money to use it, but it's more than earned its keep and the insights I've gotten from the built-in analytics have been priceless for me. Look, the bottom line is that Instapage has helped me make every cent I spend on advertising and promotions count for so much more. So I do recommend it to anyone who can afford it because it's turned out to be a great, great investment for me. All right, so that's it for this review. If you found this video helpful or interesting, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to see more videos like this. And if at this point you decide that you wanna try Instapage, you can use the affiliate link that's down in the description. It doesn't cost you anything and you might get a bit of a discount, which you wouldn't get if you went directly to their website. And as always, I enjoy hearing your thoughts and I'll try to get back to any questions or comments you leave down in the description as fast as I can. Finally, guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next video.